kind of animal you want to get pictures of, you have to do your homework. You know, do some research. Uh, get on the internet, learn what habitat they, they find, they live in. Um, are they fossorial? Are they living underground? Um, are they going to be up in the trees? You know, you just got to learn to identify the plants in the area where those animals are going to be found. Here in northwest uh, Louisiana, um, in the water, alligators are more secretive, but turtles, on a sunny day, they come out on a log. So you should be able to get some pictures of turtles on a sunny day. Maybe even your backyard, you have squirrels living there. So we got squirrels here. We have fox squirrel and um, gray squirrels. There's others that you may not want to see. We have snakes, and they're here. Um, there's one called the green snake, and it is camouflaged to blend in to the vegetation. And if you're out there shooting a picture of a butterfly, you might see a little green snake. And they're not venomous, they eat spiders, and they're, um, I think they're kind of cute. But in general, Animals that don't move around are a lot easier to take a picture of. Uh, animals that fly, uh, birds and butterflies and dragonflies, they can be hard if they're in flight, but if they land and you're patient, you might be able to get a good snapshot. Uh, mammals are a little more tricky. You know, they're uh, more cautious, shy, and they're gonna run away and hide. So there you'd probably have to uh, sit in kind of like a blind and maybe some camo gear and uh, kind of hide real still and wait for them to come by. You can get Lots of pictures of animals here at the Wildlife Refuge.